Hey everyone, it's Francis Xavier, along with my custom videos one at a time, and here we are with a surprising thing I found at uh, Walmart when I was out shopping for socks and new work shoes. Four of uh, the quarter century anniversary Yu Gi Oh! tins offer a discount price of 15 bucks each, and not all of them had this sticker.
cut off work. My work was only like oof, three hours ago. And it was the last day of nine straight days cooking chickens at my neighbor Kroger. I thought it was only six because my I was, I was taking six days because my boss was going on vacation. But uh, I ended up being three extra days Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. But here I am now. Uh, the a fire starter, Predator, Triantis, Scareclaw, Astra, Dinomorphia, Sonic, Crawl Receptor, Exosister, Vatus, Lumberman's Intervention, Ice Jade Creation, Kingfisher, Predator.
few hundred card set, they sure like lingering on Albaz and Cash 2 and all that current stuff. Uh, East 10 are almost a year old. Shouldn't be the quarter century for much longer.
that looks like just rare. Super rare. These are the ultras. These are the prismatic secrets. I know almost nothing about all of these. Perfectly honest. They do look neat, and I'm sure they all fit well within their archetypes. I just really haven't been super into the new Yu-Gi-Oh archetypes, at least from some knowledge. Ooh, the thing's gotten the fang of Prius and already they're playing what it's most famous for. Toro, Monstacado. We don't know it for Kaiba, we know it for the Berserker Soul. Let's check the let's check the rares. We got some real truly Two S Force Retroactive. Two Bestial Album Loss. Two Branded and Central Dogmatica. Everything else is unique. Not bad. I gotta separate that ultimate fusion. And this dictator of D. Very nice looking all around. Not gonna lie. As for these prismatic secrets, 
Now we're getting to the good stuff. I know Kashtira Fenrir is... I know Kashtiras are pretty valuable these days. I know Aaron's gonna want these all this blue eye stuff. I'll not lie, I've always wanted to try a psychic deck. Here's the other Fenrir. The two Garuras. But it looks like everything else is pretty unique. All in all, not terrible, Paul. Now I will over would have liked. But then again, I honestly don't remember what's in here anyways. I guess if I was expecting to see stuff from the protagonists, I might have been disappointed. But these were nice surprises. And I'm pretty sure these paid for the tins by themselves. <laughs> uh, I'll ask Aaron what he thinks later on. Anyways, thanks for all of you for tuning in. I'm going to try and make more stuff soon. It's just hard with school and moving around and stuff and trying to figure out what I want to do with my life next, you know. Thanks all for tuning in. Hope to have more soon. This is Francis Xavier logging off.